Hey guys, Josh here and welcome back to another Story of Seasons Pioneers of Olive Town video. So today's the second day of summer. I feel like time has been flying by so fast. We're already done with spring. Um, so now you can hear the beautiful and <laughs> lovely summer song and some of my crops died but interestingly actually there are some crops that are growing both in spring and summer which is the case for the tea and for the rice so actually there's something special i want to do today um we're gonna take care of our crops a little bit later uh i'm just gonna get my animals out so actually I have been gathering resources for the last days and I'm going to be able to open up a new area of my farm and then after that I'm gonna be able to repair the stable and I think potentially another building and there's also the beehive anyway there's gonna be tons of things to discover in this new area so I'm really really looking forward to it but yeah, let's just take care of our animals first before I forget. All right, I still have just one cow, one chicken. Uh, all right, so you come over here. So this is the second area, right? That you unlock this after you build the first bridge. And after that, you come over here. Then you gotta fix this area. And you need 50 hardwood planks, 20 silver ingots, and 50 mortars. And especially like the hardwood planks and the silver ingots take such a long time to get. But we finally have them, so now is the time to repair. I don't know how it's gonna look like. Oh, we've got some cutscene. So Nigel is saying, oh, you still have something to ask me? Oh yeah, so he's gonna be the one who's gonna repair this. You want to get rid of that big stone and that's a lot of work yes it is i'm gonna get started working right now okay so yeah just like with the bridge i think it's gonna take a day so we're not gonna be able to see that right away and i don't know if he's gonna build like a staircase or if he's just gonna move because it you need our you need silver and stuff so i don't know if he's gonna actually build something or just clear the path um, but yeah, actually we, we can't see that right away. So we're just gonna let the suspense build up and maybe we can get actually my garden ready for summer a little bit, uh, cause it's the second day and there's gonna be new crops, um, new seeds and stuff that I can buy at the store. Um, hopefully, oh, actually today's Monday and I feel like... The general store is closed on Monday, so I might not be able to buy seeds. I'm not too sure. But anyway, there's still a few things to do on our farm, so I'm gonna just clean things up. I think what I would like to do is to move my chicken coop over here somewhere. Maybe I wanna have like one area just for like my animals and one area for my farming, my garden. So I'm not too, too sure yet of what I'm going to do. Getting some salt. And yeah, um, I'm not too sure. This area is quite big, so I can't even Imagine, like, <laughs> I've never played the Story of Seasons game where... Oh, is there some animal there? Oh, let me take my camera, actually. I think I'm seeing something interesting. Let me just take a look. Yes, there's actually a sheep. Yeah, oh my gosh, it's my first time to see... Beside the starting animals, it's my first time to see an actual wild animal that you can get. Uh, beside, like, the first cow and the first chicken. So, that's a friendly sheep. I haven't noticed any difference like with their personalities so far okay all right so let's move all right so what should be their name all right so his name is gonna be fafa i feel like i'm so boring with my names but that's okay we now have a sheep so let's see how 
he's doing. I don't know if I can already shave him. I don't think I can. Maybe his wool still needs to grow or maybe tomorrow. I don't know. But yeah, that's exciting. We, we have another animal. But yeah, we have so much space on our farm. So I'm not sure what kind of projects, what kind of things. Like there's just so much. Um, what? <laughs> Did you guys see my chicken in the river? I don't know if I go back. Oh no, okay. He's fine. Yeah, that was <laughs> that was kind of weird. Um, yeah, you know what? I think I can move my chicken coop somewhere like... Hmm, what about having a chicken coop here? How would that be? Like having all of my animals around this area over here. And... Having crops and other things near my house, I think that would not be such a bad idea. So maybe we can do that. Got some silver and iron. These rocks are spawning so f everything is spawning so fast. I had the chance to talk about this during the live stream, uh, but. Yeah, I feel like every day, every day you're gonna get these little saplings growing. So if you don't keep up with the cleaning and just like making things tidy again, it's gonna really become a huge mess. So I'm gonna show you how you move a building. So it's really easy, how it's the same way to move anything. Basically, you just go there, you press B. And yes, and you lose if there's anything like the folder and other stuff, you lose them and you just pick it up. It's just an item. And the thing is, you can't have it too close to the mountains or anything, but I would like to have them maybe side by side, maybe. How does it look if I do something like this? And that's my chicken house. All right, and then... I don't know how that looks. I don't know. I'm gonna leave it like this for now. I'm probably gonna change it later. And I will also, actually, you can make them bigger. You can expand them. So they're not gonna stay that small forever. So this is, oops. <laughs> I didn't mean to eat my mayonnaise, but that's okay. Um, yeah, everything is gonna get bigger eventually. So it's just temporary. And you know one thing that I don't really like is I was hoping to put the mayonnaise maker in my uh, chicken coop, but you can't actually put anything here, which is too bad. <laughs> so you have to actually put the mayonnaise maker outside. But yeah, I'm just hoping, so if you guys haven't seen over there, there's like a big building. I have no idea what is this going to be. Maybe we're gonna be able to access it tomorrow and maybe get some clue. But I'm hoping we have a like a big building where you can put all the makers because <laughs> I mean, they're not the most aesthetically pleasing thing, right? So it's already 1 p.m. Okay, let's just, oh, I'm gonna have to put this back for my little chicken. Uh, okay, let's take a look at the shop. I'm pretty sure it's closed today actually, but let me just be 100% sure. I love this <laughs> little sheep jumping, that's so cute. Yeah, I really like the summer song so far. All right, and in town it's always the same song. Oh no, so it's closed on, I see, okay, so it's open today actually. It is open, so what shall we buy? There's gonna be so many new seeds. So there's a few things that grow in both spring and summer, but we have this summer crop, so we have pumpkins, we have a corn, a tomato, a bell pepper, eggplant, <laughs> sorry I forgot, um, and bell pepper, well the red one and the green one pepper, uh, radish who grew in uh, spring as well. So oh, this one, uh, eggplant and the green bell pepper grow in autumn as well. So I'm thinking what we can do, we have quite a bit of money right now. I don't want to spend everything, but I can 
use a lot and I think I'm gonna plant so at the beginning of this season I like to buy things that can grow multiple times right that you don't have to plant again and again so maybe we could go with corn how much so I want to make it aesthetically pleasing this time so I want to buy like an amount that's gonna look good you know I'm gonna do I think I'm gonna do like the classic 9x9 did I say 9x9? I mean 3x3, three three, right? The little classic 3x3. Three three. So that will be like 27. Maybe we can buy 27 of this. Oh, my bag is full already. Okay, you know what? Okay, <laughs> I didn't expect... Oh, yeah, my bag is already full. Okay, so you know what? Let's make some space so we can actually buy more seeds. Alright. So now let's buy more seeds. All right, so we bought 27 corn. Maybe we can buy some pumpkins. Maybe I feel like I don't want to have too many pumpkins. Maybe just nine. And tomato. So tomato grows again, right? It grows many times. So maybe we can have 27 too. So lots of tomatoes, lots of corn. And pepper, maybe nine. My gosh, I'm spending a lot and eggplant and okay, like this one, the pepper, this one nine, and this one ah, six. That's not a nice number. You know what? Okay, we're gonna go. Uh, oh, these are expensive. Okay, let's buy mm, something cheaper. Okay, let's buy nine more pumpkins. Yes. All right, and now we are back to being broke, but. I'm sure when everything grows, we're going to make quite a good profit. All right, so we are back. So I think I'm going to move my makers and maybe I can... Okay, you know what? Let's just clean everything. I don't think I'm going to be able to plant everything and do everything today. Maybe we're going to have to do this over two different days, but let's clean this up. Clean this up. And I can't wait to have maybe I should do that quite soon. So I was keeping all of my silver for uh, unlocking the other area, but I actually cannot wait to upgrade my tools to the silver tools, especially with all of my new crops. I feel like I'm going to spend a lot of time every day just watering everything, but it's going to be worth it. And I don't know if we're going to get access to another mine. Oops. I don't know if we're going to get access to a new mine. Which, in which maybe we'll be able to find some gold. Alright, so I think we're now ready to start. So my plan is to do something like, like this. So I'm going to make three by three squares. So that's going to be one square and then two and then three and then one and then two and then three. So it's going to be nine by nine, uh, three by three. Well, in total, it's going to be nine by nine. Anyway, you guys get what I mean, right? There's going to be three big squares by three big squares. And it's already almost five PM. I'm not sure I'm gonna have the time for that. Maybe we. We'll, mm. Maybe I'm gonna have to go to the bistro, get something to eat. All right. So we are just about done with our field. So I think I'm gonna do something like that. So I still gonna have a space for a path here, and here I'm gonna. <laughs> this area looks super messy. I have no plan for this yet. Uh, but let's just go to the bistro and get something to eat. I'm not even sure with my 447 if I even have enough for like a full meal. But let's see. Main dish. Oh, you know what? I have way more. You know what? I feel like I always eat the same thing. Oh, what's in there? Other vegetable juice and yogurt to drink okay I don't think that's gonna fill me up we have soups 
yellow potage that sounds interesting but you know what? i think what's gonna give me the most energy is main dish so let's get some omelette an omelette that looks like fish as always and do we have enough for a dessert yes let's have some pudding And now we should have quite a bit of energy. We're at like 75%. Um, so hopefully that's enough to water our crops and plant them, actually. All right, so now is the fun part, the easy part. So here, I'm gonna do tomato. So yeah, when you level up your skills, it gets easier. You can plant more than one seed at once. I don't know if later you're gonna be able to plant even more than that. Um, and so that's tomato and now we're doing corn. So it's gonna be all neat and pretty. So if I put sprinkler, so I think the sprinkler is just to like one of like, just the eight things around so if I would use sprinkles I mean sprinklers I why do I keep saying sprinkles I think I would need to put them like here right like in the middle um, but yeah I'm not doing sprinklers yet yeah I feel like I think in my previous video I've also said sprinklers sprinkles quite a few times um, okay uh, paprika and the green bell pepper well you know what i'm gonna keep this one for later you know what because that's gonna be a lot of work to water everything so this and i don't think it even takes any energy right to uh plant the seeds i feel like it didn't go down which is good because now i have to water I feel like that was not such a good idea to put the tree here and the problem with the trees is that they take like 15 days to grow like they take a really long time to grow and then you can't really move them so and my beautiful cherry tree is probably <laughs> I'm probably gonna cut it eventually for just to place something else in that area so yeah I'm probably gonna see you guys in a minute I'm not gonna I'm gonna let you skip this part. All right guys, so I didn't think I would make it, but I still have about two hearts and it's 10 p.m. So we should be good to finish, which is amazing. It's gonna be quite short, not too much energy and not too much time left. But there it is guys, we have our summer garden. I mean, it's very basic for now, but it's still I think this is still a hundred times better than whatever this... Oh my gosh, I still have to water these guys actually. I I almost want to skip them, but <laughs> they need water as well. Okay, let's just do that very quickly. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of work because I'm going to have to do this every day, which is a lot. Ah, I, mm, I don't have energy for my tea. Okay, let's see if there's anything. Okay, let me try to eat something. Um, I could take a bath, but if you take a bath, it takes 30 minutes. Actually, if you cook, it takes time to... Um, vegetable juice, vegetable salad. Okay, so let's put a radish in here. And a turnip. Yeah, it takes 30 minutes. So let's see how that goes. Alright, so let's see how much energy that salad gives me. Oh, you can actually... Did you guys see? I have one extra heart. I didn't realize. So actually, if you eat food, it can actually increase your maximum of hearts. So I'm guessing though, like tomorrow is probably going to go back to normal. But that's something definitely to keep in mind like if you want to go mining or something you can 
Oh yeah, that's good to know. Or maybe is it a permanent increase? Maybe if you eat a lot, like you just get stronger permanently? I don't know. Ah, one. Are we gonna pass out? So close, <laughs> so close, but we made it, guys. We survived. Let's say goodnight to Mickey and let's go to sleep. It's late and we're so tired. So I'm wondering if my extra heart is still gonna be there. Oh no, okay, so yeah, the extra heart goes away, but that's good to keep in mind um, on days that you need to do lots of things. And you might have noticed I don't even have all of my stamina today because we were tired yesterday and we went to bed late. So I'm thinking, oh, oh yeah, we're gonna have a cutscene. Ooh, so that's the new area. So I'm not sure why he needed silver and that much wood <laughs> just to empty the area, but all right, so let's go take a look at our new area. So here's our new little farm. I feel like it's <laughs> growing so quickly. Uh, so let's go see. Let's put our little, let's let our animals come out. Oh, I forgot. I feel so bad. I forgot to put food for my chicken. I completely forgot. But, oh, she still laid an egg. So I think if we go outside, they might not have... Oh, my father is still in my one of my boxes. So I need to do that by the end of the day. But yeah, and now let's go and take a look at our new area, which is the whole purpose of this video. So here we have a horse. But of course, before we can adopt it, we're gonna have to repair this. And over here we have the beehive. So there's another kind of wood again, and another kind of leaves, which are gonna be these leaves here. And then what do we have? So there's the building over here. I'm very curious to see what this is. So this looks like some kind of water something plant. Um, so I'm curious to see what we're actually going to be able to do once that is repaired. Oh, we've got an alpaca right here. Let's add up our alpaca. We're getting so many <laughs> new animals in today's video. So what should be his name? So she's gonna be Lala. So we got Fafa and Lala today. Oh, I can shave my sheep now, actually. All right. So I don't know if they get wool every day. I feel like that would be a lot. Usually in Story of Seasons, you need to wait quite a few days. But already on the second day, we had wool from our sheep. So who knows? <laughs> I guess we're going to see that soon. Uh, oh, and I think we have another beach here. Yes. Oh, that's a, quite a big. Oh, I think that's a new bird gonna take a little picture for the museum ah I missed it my bad <laughs> and it disappears so quickly right when it starts flying oh we've got another ooh a black and white chicken why are there so many animals today all all of a sudden we're getting so many animals um okay so this is a serious chicken oh okay I don't know if it's gonna lay like black and white eggs or something all right, his name's gonna be Toto. All right, you guys think we're gonna get another animal again today? Yeah, this area is so you. Oh, there's a little beetle. Oh, there's two different ones. So we need to take pictures for the museum. I don't know if you can eventually get a better camera because now I can only save up to 10 pictures and that's just <laughs> not a lot. So we're gonna bring these to the museum. Uh, the pictures. Oh, there's something here. Oh, oh, this is a silo. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. So we're gonna have a silo. I'm not sure what we're gonna be able to do with this. There's new mushrooms. Oh, there's a little pond there. I don't know if there's gonna be maybe little frogs or something. 
and you can't go down but let's take a look with our camera oh my gosh so i think all of this like all of these fields maybe we're gonna be able to go there eventually or maybe is it just i don't know is it just decor or, Ooh, i think for me that looks like gold possibly and oh and possibly a fruit tree over there and uh, possibly a bridge to repair and oh, silver and guts again and some wood and if you come over here okay so this area you can't go yet so you need to repair the bridge before you can get to the new mine and get gold and then with the gold you can get the new gold tools and all of that fun stuff so yeah there is definitely a lot that we've unlocked with this new area so that is quite exciting um however that being said it's already uh i think i don't know if my next goal should be to fix this stable or to fix the water thing we're gonna have to think about that that's gonna be pretty much it for today guys so i hope you enjoyed this video we've unlocked a new area and i'm looking forward to repairing all of the things that we have over there and uh yeah let me know in the comments what you think about the water building and what's gonna be in there and if there's anything you'd like to see in the future story of seasons video please let me know in the comments and if you want to see more content like this feel free to click like and subscribe if you don't want to miss out so all right thank you so much for watching guys and i'm gonna see you next time